What's up everyone, Take Down here, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about what to do if your PlayStation 4 is not reading discs. Let's get right into this. First, let's check for any obvious physical issues. Make sure that there's no scratches, dirt, or debris on the game itself, the physical disc. Give it a gentle wipe with a microfiber cloth to remove any smudges. Once the disc is clean, try inserting it back into the PlayStation 4 and see if it can now be read. If there are deep scratches on the disc and it can't be cleaned by wiping it, they probably are too deep and that game will no longer work. If the disc does look fine, let's move on to the next step. Next, you're going to try to simply power cycle the PlayStation 4. To do this, you're going to turn off your PlayStation 4, you're going to unplug the cable from the back, the power cable, and then you're going to press and hold the power button on the PlayStation 4 while everything's unplugged, and you're going to press and hold that for about 10 seconds. After you've pressed the power button for 10 seconds, you're going to release it, and you're going to let it sit unplugged for an additional 30 seconds or longer if you wish. After you've let it sit, you can plug the power cable back in and plug your console back into the outlets and try to turning it on and see if it will now read your discs. If that doesn't work, you're going to want to go into the PlayStation 4 settings to see if the console itself has a new update that didn't automatically pop up. If an update is pending, complete the update before testing the game once again. Also, if it's only certain games that are not working properly, check to make sure there's not an update for those individual games before trying to play it. If there is an update pending, complete the update for those individual games before trying to see if the disc will work once again. Next, if that didn't work, you're going to try to rebuild the database which is super easy to do as well. What you're going to want to do is enter safe mode. To do this, you're going to turn off your PS4. You're going to press and hold the power button until you hear two beeps, and this should launch it into safe mode. You should see it appear on the screen, after which time all you need to do is connect the cable to the console and connect your controller to it, and then you'll be able to navigate through safe mode. You're going to want to select the rebuild database option, and you're going to want to complete the on-screen steps. Now, depending on how much you have saved on your PlayStation 4, it might might take a little bit longer for you to complete this step, but you're going to want to be patient, complete the step, follow the on-screen instructions, and hopefully now your games will work. Hopefully one of the other methods that I did mention did work. Most of the time, power cycling it and cleaning the disc will work, but remember, if there's deep scratches, that game will likely no longer work again. Hopefully something did work for you, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.